Blue Nose Pit Bulls may be the latest in breeder inventions, but are they the breed for you? Their name and appearance are a bit deceiving. Blue Nose Pit Bulls are actually extremely loving, loyal, and even good with children. These dogs have striking looks that help them stand out in a crowd. Blue Nose Pit Bulls with blue eyes are especially stunning, and the Blue Nose Brindle Pit Bull coloring adds an exotic flair. Today, in this video, I will show you some good information of Blue Nose Pit Bull you should know about. Let's jump on it. What is a Blue Nose Pit Bull? The Blue Nose Pit Bull is either an American Pit Bull Terrier or American Staffordshire Terrier or a mix of both. They have specific genes to make their coat a blue-like color. They are a rare dog because the coloring is caused by recessive genes. To express these genes, breeders need two parents who are blue to produce blue puppies. The History of the Blue Nose Pitbull The Pitbull came into existence during the 19th century in the United Kingdom when a Bulldog and Terrier were crossbred. This was done as a way to help promote athleticism in the dogs as well as give it a muscular stature. The Blue Nose Pitbull is a regular type of Pitbull except for a slight pigment change in their nose. Why do they have a blue nose? A blue pit bull has a blue nose due to a genetic issue which is caused by a black color dilation in the skin. Because of pigmentation, their nose will turn a slight bluish gray color. However, a blue nose pit bull often suffers from various health issues due to this genetic change, which can cause their genes to malfunction. This includes premature hair loss and a poor immune system. What color coat does a blue nose pit bull have? A blue nose pit bull tends to have a silverish coat, which provides a unique contrast with their blue nose. Their short hair tends to have a very glossy appearance. How big does a blue nose pit bull get? A male pit bull will usually grow to be about 21 inches tall, while females are around 19 to 20 inches tall. Depending on the dog, they could weigh anywhere from 30 to 90 pounds. Are blue nose pit bulls dangerous? Pit bulls often have a reputation for being dangerous animals. However, this isn't the case. Pit bulls tend to be very loving dogs. While they can be somewhat energetic, they are never intentionally aggressive and hurtful. Pit bulls who are not properly socialized and mistreated can be dangerous though. This is because of the poor and abusive treatment put toward them and the dog being a little socially awkward around other people and animals. Blue Nose Pit Bull Training Blue Nose Pit Bulls are brilliant, which is sometimes hard to believe since this breed has particularly silly faces at times. They are very easy to train because they are smart enough to understand and remember instructions. However, they can also be stubborn during training if they do not feel like they are getting their way, which can be a little bit difficult at times. Health Considerations of Blue Nose Pit Bulls The Blue Nose Pit Bull is a relatively healthy breed, but they are prone to skin diseases such as mange, which is a skin disease caused by parasitic mites. Symptoms of mange are hair loss, excessive itching, and the formation of scabs or lesions. While this breed is derived from a relatively small gene pool, they are in general prone to more genetic problems. Grooming Blue Nose Pit Bulls Grooming is a breeze for these dogs, since they have a short coat, a once-over brushing may be enough on a weekly basis. They will need to have their teeth brushed regularly and ears checked and cleaned as needed. Their nails grow quickly, so they should be trimmed or filed down using a grinder or metal file. Are Blue Nose Pit Bulls a unique breed? This is false. Blue Nose Pit Bulls are not a separate breed from the American Pit Bull Terrier. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. The only difference between them and other American Pit Bull Terriers is the nose color. Non-blue nose pit bulls can give birth to puppies with blue noses. It just comes down to a genetic trait for a blue coloring of the nose, which brings up our next point. If I missed any information, let me know by commenting below. Thanks for watching this video. You're invited to watch more videos and subscribe to our channel for more updates. Thank you.